Hello everybody, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to be playing some Amnesia The Bunker. I think we left off doing the Arsenal thing, so we're going to do that. Um, so yeah, I forgot, but it's okay. Um, it's alright, I'll figure it out. Yeah, I, I don't remember where the, what the frick I have to do in this, um, but I know that it involves avoiding the monster quite a lot, so um, frick. I guess, you know? <laughs> Alright, uh, I remember there was, yeah, a trap there. So if I want to go there, I'm going to have to go around this way. Right. Okay, to the tunnels. So we're not going to do that. Because we don't have to go there, I don't think. Okay, that's a locked door. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, I'm just making sure that there's no dang, you know, frickin' monster. Hey, yeah! Okay, what's the code again? I think it's 1319, right? 1319. I dang, I frickin' remember that. Holy crap. Uh. That's crazy. Okay, uh. Oh, frick. Hold on. Wait a second. What's going Oh, yeah. I know what I need to do. Turn my volume up. Frick! It is loud already. Uh. I need you to break the bookshelf down, please. Could you please, sir? I need you to do that. The frick? <laughs> You're telling me that I can't... What the frick? Frick. Frick. Holy frick. It's okay, it's okay. Holy frick. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, I remember this part. Yeah. Is he really not coming? Yeah. 
He's coming. Don't be fooled. Because he's coming. He, uh... Yep. Yeah. Holy frick. Please don't kill me. I don't want to die. What did you just do? What? Ah! What the frick, dude? Is he made of grenades now? The frick? Okay. Okay. Okay, this isn't that bad. Okay. I'm looking out for the traps, man. I don't trust that crap. Booyah! Check it, baby. Okay. Okay, I'll say that we have made quite a bit more progress than we did previously. Which is good. Which is good. But I wish there was a save or something. Holy frick, dude. Frick. Frick, dude.
Go back in your hole, mother fricker. Go back in your hole where you belong. You don't like the the hole, do you? Me and you are obviously two very different people. Come on, bro. Come on, it's not that hard. Just 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 go back in the hole. You know what? I'm I'm tempted to just walk out. You're being annoying. You are nothing but a nuisance. Okay. Okay. Holy frick. I'm sorry for not talking, guys. I just, I mean, this is a little too intense for me. To be honest. This is extremely intense. So I can't be doing this, man. It's bad for my health. It's probably bad for everybody's health to play horror games all the time, but you know what? It's fine. Now I have dynamite. The first thing I want to do with this dynamite is put it where it's supposed to go. At that exit, right there. That's the whole point of this game, is to blow up the exit. I've not seen another human for hours now. I might be the last. But in the hope that there might be another, I leave this now so you don't waste any time. This is the only exit, the only way to make it out of this heck of our own making. It was blown closed. It needs to be blown open. Don't bother digging. Impossible. Blow it up. The dynamite is locked in the arsenal. The detonator handle is somewhere down in the Roman tunnels deeper in heck. I go now to retrieve them both. Though I do not know if you exist, I pray for you. Please extend me the same courtesy. I mean, I'll pray for you, there's a good chance you're already dead. Okay. Stick the thingy in the dynamite. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah, I need to go back in the arsenal. Apparently. Alright, I think I need to probably go to maintenance. Or prison. Uh, I'll go to maintenance first. Because I feel like that's our best bet. So I'm just going to go to maintenance. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. So I need to go down here. 
take a left and then not this hallway but uh, this one yeah oh. frick 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 frickin frick Hey! I've got to get the generator running before I do this. I have a feeling that if I don't, it's going to be very bad. For me. It's too bad that I don't have any fuel except for two cans, which isn't even, it, it isn't even enough to fill it halfway. So that's really a problem. But, but, I'll find a way. Um, well, I know this probably isn't going to be a short visit, so it's really concerning that I only have four lines of fuel, which is, what, 25 minutes or something? That's very concerning. I need more fuel. I need a lot more fuel, preferably, but I don't feel like I'm going to get a lot more fuel. Unless I... I am bleeding quite badly. So... I feel like the only thing to do here... Is I just go in there! Okay. Okay, it's not trapped, but it's boarded. Which, really, before I do that. Okay, no traps. There's a cloth, which is good for my health. A gas grenade, which is kind of pointless. Ah. Frick.
Holy frick. Oh, frick. You're freaking me right now. Okay. My theory is true. I didn't want to have to find out, but it's true. Okay? That's good. More fuel. Have you noticed how the rats have changed down here lately? Ever since they opened up those tunnels, I swear the rats have gotten uglier, like they're disfigured or something, and they're definitely more aggressive. Tell me I'm not going crazy. I don't know, man. I don't want to stick! Now that I could get behind. I'm gonna need another bandage, though. Interesting. Yeah, this is a very dangerous place to be. Whoa! Holy frick. Yo! Coming in clutch like that! Okay! Gavin, I promised you a Christian burial, but you must understand, the rats would not stop coming. They swarmed your body, their teeth, their claws. They would not stop. I did what our ancestors did when faced with unclean things, burnt them, and I burnt what was left of you to stop them coming again. If you made it to heaven, please forgive me. I remain down here in hell with that demon. I it will come for me again soon. I know it. I'm going to do as you suggested before you died. Make the for the pillbox. Please, if you're up there, watch over me. An empty bottle with a cloth. Interesting. Um, oh, that's... A fuel bottle. Huh. A fuel bottle. Very interesting. A petrol bomb? Requires a lighter to use. Like I just have a lighter? Like, really? Come on now. Dang it! Okay, I am going to use this opportunity to uh, use the bathroom. <laughs> okay. This is terrifying. I would like everybody to realize just how terrifying it really is. Pantry. Well, that's useless. Um. Alrighty. Workshop. The door's already open. 
Okay. Okay, that's a lot of rats. Yeah, I don't see me getting through that unless I have a grenade. <gasps> oh, no. Okay, I need to... I'm contemplating going back to the generator and filling it up. I don't know. There's a fresh scratch on it, it looks like. What's in here? Yes, I see. Just slightly terrifying. Oh. Yes. I am that guy who did that thing. What thing? I... That thing, you know? The thing. You don't know I'm in here, so don't open the door. You don't know I'm in here. You don't know I'm in here. Don't shoot me! I'm sorry, I didn't mean to! Hands up! In the air, party like we don't care. Alright. It's almost like he knew I was in here or something, which can't be possible. This guy is pretty creepy. This guy is pretty creepy. You can't kill me because you don't know I'm in here. You can't kill me. You don't know I'm in here. Okay, I'm walking into the once locked but now open room. Why is everything difficult? I am going to run back real quick because I need a few things. If I'm not mistaken, the lighter is in the mission storage locked under a code. And you would think that they might... that they possibly might have it available now. Or I might have possibly unlocked the code for it. Because I need a lighter for that part. Because I need a torch. I I, I know that um, I got some tips 
that if I want to scare away the um if I want to scare away the rats I have to get a torch and and like I guess that's what a stick is for I mean if I had to guess a stick and cloth possibly and uh, I mean probably if I had to guess okay I don't want to turn it on just yet. I'm going to go to mission storage first before I turn it on. And then, only then, will I, uh, well, frick, turn the generator on. Because I don't want to waste any gas I don't have to waste. I'm going to try to keep it topped off as best as I possibly can. What is that? Oh, I thought that was a gas can. <laughs> Crazy me. Okay, um, Clement. Do I have Gira? <gasps> 5376. There we go! Okay, uh... Laval? Stafford. He's the guy with the wrench. Clement. Wait. Oh, gas mask. 2949? I don't know if that's necessary right now, so I'm going to leave that there for, for just the time being. 9776. Eighth of July, mid afternoon. Joubert needs a scout for tonight. Routine patrol. Out to the communication wires and back. It'll be cloudy. Good cover. Easiest patrol possible. Sergeant wants me or Augustin to go. He still suspects one of us might have been with the mutineers. But I won't be going. How can I be so sure? Well, Augustin has agreed to a friendly game of chance to determine which of us it will be. And... Using an old sleight of hand trick, there's no way I'll lose. <laughs> no, Augustin doesn't have a chance because I'll ensure he doesn't. Huh? Me? A scoundrel? <laughs> Perhaps. But when he returns and I remind him of the time he pissed in my flask, or the mysterious lice that appeared in my bunk, or the incident with that barmaid, <laughs> well, I laughed in those cases. And he'll laugh in this one. Okay. So Eight he cheated. July, near midnight. Shelling again somewhere along the line. Them firing at us. I'm sure we will fire at them again soon. I hope Augustan's having a simply marvelous time. Out there. <laughs> Can't wait to tell him what I did. Okay. Of July. Time unknown. It must be just before dawn. When the shelling stopped, I woke. The sudden silence always does that. Augustin's bunk is... empty. I went looking for him. He wasn't in the mess, nor being seen by Dr. Jozinski, nor lurking out for a final smoke. Dax was on patrol. I asked him. He said Augustin hasn't returned from the scout. He said the words like he was pronouncing Augustin's death. As if scouts don't come running back at all hours. As if... As if it wasn't just a routine patrol. As if... All hope was lost. Now, the shelling is starting again. Uh, we'll try to sleep. 
9th of July, morning. Okay. It has been hours now, and Augustin has not returned. His luck did not hold, and neither has mine. What could I have been thinking? If he is gone forever... But I do not want to write it, for fear writing it will make it real. I will continue to wait in my bunk until dusk. And if there is no sign of him, then... Then... Then I do not know. The priest keeps staring at me, as if he can sense I have some unseen weight on me. I will not give him the satisfaction of a confession. It was nothing. A joke. I, I thought it was just a joke. I, I never thought. I, I never thought. And therein lies my sin. That was a lot. But, alright, man. Alright, that's gonna come in handy. Um, it would be preferable if I had three bullets, just in case I had to shoot the monster. But that's alright if I don't, you know? It's alright. It's alright. So I only have, like, a couple lockers. Wait a second. Yeah. Well, technically I have more than a couple. But who's really counting, right? Where did that even come from? It just randomly appeared on the floor. It's alright. Okay. Okay. That is a full. Okay. That's. I wonder if there's like a limited amount that I can use that. I feel like that's a good question to ask here. Um, but, eh, you know what? Whatever. Okay, I can turn on the lights now. Um, which another good question is, the more lights you have turned on, it, does that run the generator down faster? Because, like, that's a little confusing, and I would like to know answers. Uh... Do you get scared by fire? No. I guess I have to have a torch, in specific. Frick away from me! Okay. Okay. Now I need a stick and some cloth. Oh, uh, I should probably... Okay. Um. Okay, I need to find a. There is no way. Okay. Okay. Good. Good. Uh. Well.
Why did I have to scream? Was that necessary? Okay. Dusk. I sit now at the bedside of my dear friend Henri Clément. The doctor has left, but I remain. I feel I must record the extraordinary twists of fate and fortune that have led me to be here, breathing, alive, strong and well, while Henri lies unconscious, fighting for his life. It starts days ago, on a night patrol. I fell into some kind of pit. I was injured, unable to move, unable to escape. By all rights, it should have been my tomb. Okay. I cried for help. I screamed myself hoarse. The effort left me parched, exhausted, and still low. As the next night fell, as I cried what might have been my last cry for help, I could see the stars high, high above, beautiful, indifferent. And then Clément's face appeared at the top of the pit. He lowered himself to me found a trickle of spring water there and let me drink from it. It was cool and crisp with a strange, sweet taste. Never has water felt more nourishing than that. Administered by a dear friend's hand. Huh. Saved. But of course, that is not the last twist fate's blade would stab into my back. Huh. Interesting. Night. Later now, I continue my tale. As Clément carried me across no man's land, fate struck again. A German outpost spotted us. Gunfire, explosions, desperation. Uh huh. And as the air cleared, I pulled myself to my feet and saw that Henri was wounded, blood pouring from his head, his eyes glassy. He was fading. Huh. I do not know where I found the strength to carry him, but carry him I did, all the way back to our bunker. July, That's interesting. Because I thought that you looked pretty rough. This morning and realized that a toy I purchased for my son is gone. I promised him I'd bring him something home from the front, so I brought him a stuffed rabbit from a local shop. <laughs> a rabbit because he thinks he's so fast. It must have fallen from my pack when I fell into the crater. The thought of that stuffed rabbit lying in that crater, rain and weather met in its fur, unloved, huh. forgotten. Totally alone. Lost forever. It fills me with profound hopelessness. Ha. Huh. 12th July, 1960. Interesting. Afternoon. Spoke to the doctor. He told me Henri woke in the night and had no recollection of the events in the crater. Indeed, he seemed even confused as to where he was. Uh -huh. Aside from this disturbing news, I'm feeling rather good. Stronger and stronger. As if the whole ordeal has filled both my body and soul with new purpose. That's great, buddy. Can this thing run out, please? Holy frick! Oh, 
Holy frick! He almost got me, that mother fricker! He was this close! That, that close! So what exactly do I? Pillbox key. I has a pillbox key now. Who oh boy? What? You know what, everybody? I'm just gonna leave it here for now. Um. Because <laughs> obviously I'm amnesia'd out for today. Uh, what the frick? Okay. Um. If you enjoyed, please leave a like. Remember to subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.